they also have to assault and clear out that other base, and that's when things are going to get interesting. I think they're concerned about uh, IDs having been blown up by them already. Airtime! Holy shit! The heli is down! The heli is down! How is the heli down? Oh my god! It's another catastrophe! The JDAM hit the fucking helicopter! <laughs> It's another catastrophe. Another catastrophe. What happened? We will never know. Oh my god. What happened? My god. Right, now, remember what we were saying before about how, like, whatever, how long it was was too easy. Well, it's five past, and what did I say? 23 past, did I say? 23? 22? So they've got uh, 15, 17 left on this one, but it's super easy. We know they've only got a few units on it, so there shouldn't be any issue at all. My god. My god! What is happening? Oh, caves, not caves. Caves. Armor Caves, the destroyer of frames. Whenever I do cave missions, it always annihilates frames on missions. Just absolutely scrubs them. It makes securing the Blackhawk side objective for more time. No, they don't need more time on this one. There's no more time. If they if they can't do this, then it's fail. They got like five guys here. Like these two guys should be able to clear it before anybody else gets it. Garfield and Gal guys. Oh, it's, good. it's Garfield and Jimbo. Oh shit, Jimbo's just in, in the mix. Oh fuck, they're on it! I didn't even see them stealth. Look at this, Ethan. Ethan is not fucking around. He's just like, get in! Look at this. Oh shit. Both took a hit. Oh shit. Panda is down. They are not messing around on this. They are not messing around at all. They've already annihilated several of the guys that are in the compound here. They've just... That's... They're like literally... Oh shit, look at this guy! He's up! He's up! He's up! Take him out! They... What the fuck? Post! 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 No! Oh, no! How is it possible? It's all on Ethan and he's fucking mission commander! Oh my god! Ethan! Oh my god, Ethan is fucking mission commander. Holy mother of god. Go on, Ethan. Go on, Ethan. No! <laughs> oh my god. God, <laughs> I th I thought he was gonna get it. For Christ's sake! Oh, what's happening? Oh no! Oh my days! All right, Garfield, right here. Pushing in. Get him! R Hit him. Jesus Pushing. Christ! <laughs> oh my God! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, where's where's the scenario? Judge, where's, where's the thing? I didn't place the mission awesome. intel. So we have here the next thing. Okay. Should have some then we here. this time don't activate it. We have time, so don't yeah. activate anything. I think. Yeah. Get all the sectors we have two, we have out. Two guys down, do we? Lawrence, Lawrence, look, look. With your eyes. I'll find it eventually. I'm going to do the next one so I don't forget. <sighs> My lord. I mean, this has been a really fun mission, but the stress, the stress of it. Stress is too much for me to bear right now. Oh, so much stress. Right, okay, let's do this one. I can't, can't deal with it, you guys. I can't deal with it. God. I'm just I'm just setting up some flashpoints here. Yep. 
Christ alive. Ethan, this is RT Dream here. Or if he's down, someone else. Uh, yeah, bravo. Uh, good job on this compound. I also heard you, Jocko, say, uh, you know, we've got time, so wait. That's correct. You've got actually plenty of time. So sort yourselves out. You've got, I, I would say, give yourselves 10 minutes, and then I'll basically uh, do it. Also, Jocko, the, um, uh, yeah, yeah, so do your trace on the next 10 minutes. I let that Ethan do. He's currently down. Wait until he's back. Copy that. Good job. Can't believe that. Can you believe that last face, guys? What the hell? <laughs> that was so stressful. I really <laughs> remember how everyone was like, uh, remember how everyone was like, ah, oh, there's so few enemy. It's not even worth doing. It's it's not even worth doing as a base. It was just like, oh, it's easy. It's easy. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> wow. Everyone was just like, nothing can go wrong on this. They've got so much time and they've got so many people. Nothing can happen. <laughs> it's like, yeah. <laughs> you know what's amazing as well? It's just like, despite the sheer, like, I don't know, like, pain of all the bits and pieces happening, they're still doing really good. And also, like I say, I, I don't want to take anything away. Like, there have been some good funny moments happening right here, but I, I don't want to take anything away. The guys have been doing a really good job of maintaining their kind of, like, 360 coverage. They've been doing a really good job of uh, actually coordinating. Ethan's done a great Where's job on leading it. So. I try, like, my best to change you know. <laughs> everything and to make it work correctly, but try to do leading and that... And then also, like, communicating to a command that is rushing is not easy. What do you mean, the command that would run past an IED and say, this is how you do it, just before an explosion? <laughs> just before I'm about to say, here's a route you can go, and then Ethan goes on the radio. See, that wasn't so hard. <laughs> uh, they've been doing a good job. I like how they're just so relaxed. Who is this? Is this uh, Flesh yet again? Uh, gone. They're just like, where are you? Oh, there you are. There you are. Hello. <laughs> oh, dear. What are you guys talking about? Fennec. Get an armor ulcer due to overstressed Zeusing. Yeah, I kind of feel like that sometimes, to be fair. I think Lawrence has discovered the thing. Yes. I hope he doesn't think to do the actual intel yet. I think he's doing it. Because he's looking at it for a long time, I think he's gathering the intel. I don't think he realizes. Yeah, he wouldn't be staying at it for this long if he wasn't getting the intel off of it. He's going to trigger the next point. I'm not in Lawrence's group though, so I can't know when the uh, intel comes up. Intel added. Okay, how much time for the next one, guys? How much time? Well, they got four, so 45 plus the thing for doing the main base and everything, plus nine, nine minutes. So they get uh, 54. Uh, Commander Celti, did you read over it? Commander's still down. Commander's still down. Trace has been activated. You have 54 minutes. The uh, next, this, the trace has revealed the main enemy base. You need to split your team. You need to go to the uh, next. Uh, you need to go to the next communication post and destroy that, as well as do the other trace. You also need to now split your team and assault the main base. You got uh, 54 minutes on the clock. Roger that, LT. I'm not command. I uh, copy that, but regardless, Trace was activated, so not, I, I didn't call it, somebody uh, activated it, so it's on now. I know, thanks for the information, I know that. Uh, Alpha, do you copy? Questionable actions there. This is why you shouldn't do things that you haven't been assigned to do. 
I think uh, we didn't hear that, but I think there might have been some chewing out happening right there. Hang on, I'm still this guy's. He's deed. Right. Well, They've got a lot of time though. Out. Uh, Commander Celti. Commander Celti. Just a reminder, you can use your air support against the main base, which has now been marked to your northeast. Uh, you got 54 on the clock starting from now, basically. Uh, remember that the air support is not to annihilate everything they see. You need to capture, if you can, commanders, if not at least some of the guys there. They are to soften the target for you to assault. Yep, cover that. This is Alpha Second to Command. Right, so on the clock, uh, we've got command, five. Command, go ahead. So nine minutes past, guys, on the next one. Nine minutes past. they got a lot of time to do this, a lot of time. Go ahead. Hey, and also, I, I didn't call this command out. Sh stream decided most of the amount of time on this one, guys. All I did was uh, you, do read? roll my dice. Versus. Uh, could you come and give us a pickup? That's all. Also bear in mind the enemy base to the northeast is quite heavily reinforced. This is Alpha to Kiwi, can you give us a pickup? Roger that. Right, now they have pre-designated which teams are oh, what's my keys as well? Okay, yes, we're three onto there and one onto that. Okay, cool. They're moving to recon the main base. Transport's coming in to pick up those guys. See, there's a lot of logistics. There's a lot of logistics and organizing happening on this one, especially with the time element, and that's what I'm really liking with this. Command to Reaper. Give them a last assault. They have. That's what Go their next Reaper. target is. Did you want to start hitting that uh, northeast base while it's calling uh, just to slice it up? Just uh, remember. Uh, stay away from buildings and uh, don't completely annihilate it. Copy that. Hard target on. Okay, we will come to you. Holy Christ, did you see that? Did you see a Land Rover? <laughs> did you see the speed of that? I missed that. Did you see, guys, as he came over this hill? Look, look! <laughs> so much airtime. Whee! <laughs> Oh my god. Did anybody see that? Like Garfield, I think he stopped out of fear because they just literally like bailed over it. Oh my god. That was absolutely epic. Can't, can't, come on. Oh, the other teams are rolling out. myself up. <clears throat> Command is probably going for the main site up here, so I'll probably move myself in this direction. Phantom, uh, Phantom to re Go for Reaper. 
Uh, can you uh, check the airbase up there and make sure it's clear? I'm going to... not clear. You have two girls up here. Copy. The Apache is communicating through to the guys just about like what they're seeing on the site there. So what we've got here is uh, there's a mortar camp and a fuel dump right here. Man, some AA Urals. Go ahead. Quick question: the timer is that for the trace or the base? Um... It's for both actually. Just making sure. Yep, copy that. Uh, there's a little command compound right here with uh, a few of the guys, little camps and stuff like this. Uh, most of these guys are static because they're not being engaged. There is some uh, enemy armor, kind of checkpoints, etc. There's various little bunkers and compounds and stuff like this. That's where the enemy are hiding. Let's see what's going on over here. Uh, Halley and ground units going up this way. Okay, Yeti and his team look coming in with the Coyote, so that's good. They've actually sent a, a, an appropriate number of people to deal with this target. You'll be coming in at a dangerous landing zone. Dangerous landing zone. They've got loads of time to deal with this, so Copy. they're probably going to find us a clue. I don't mind if it's hot, as long as we can do it. Okay, see where the lighthouse is? Yes. You might be able to land there and have some decent cover for your guys. Or maybe at the docks, can you check the same check it out? Oh, but is there anything close? Shit. That's the Apache hitting that. So the Apache is knocking out the uh, anti-air stuff. See, this is the power when you have these guys up in the sky. And the Apache can just sit up and just pick these targets off. But it's just... Yeah, that's it. But you see how quite sporad sporadic that is? These guys aren't going to engage because he's sort of far away. You, you can see he's right up over there. I don't think there's any of these guys I can jump into either and start firing back. Well, there's one guy right here I could. Can you see it though? Maybe you can see it. Let me try. Hello. Right, what's happening? Yeah, plugs on, guys. Thanks, thanks truck. This is super helpful. This is super helpful truck. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be able to see this guy now. God, where are we going? I'm fine. Well done. You idiot. I'm done. Leading me on a merry chase. I wanted to help you, but now you've ruined us. No! No, you idiot! For God's sake. Damn it, AI. Every time. Every Set. time you do this to me. Christ. King AI. Every time. The AI. Ah, oh, dear, oh dear. Then what about limiting uh, ammo for helos or planes so they have to decide what to engage? They actually have often quite limited ammo. You'd be surprised how quickly you burn through it when you're doing an entire mission. We already did the other day... Um, mission we did on Takistan, you might remember, and um, the Apache had to clear out and go back to base after a little oh, while, so it, it definitely does happen. Time remaining, they got loads of time, they got uh, 30, uh, like 44 minutes or something, they got ages. But they have got to engage and actually battle through some of this. There we go, that goes the Ural, he's down, GBU striked. The heli is down on the ground here on the coast, That's some good line of sight insertion there. I'm underwater.
Copy that, Phantom. Great Advise line me. of sight session. Excellent. I just want to say excellent work still again by everyone. I've uh, really, you know, from some of the missions we've done. Going really good, really good. Like Garfield and Jimbo just banging in here. Look at it. No mercy, no fear. However, there is a lot of enemies about to get activated right here, and this is when your frames can go out the window. Well, guys, tell me. Oh shit! Holy fuck! That sounded like a missile from a. Uh, the hell was that? It was a jeep. That sounded like a missile from the Apache. That was a Hellfire missile. As on the stream and also YouTube comments as well, if you've enjoyed the mission today, guys, just tell me what you think in the uh, comments down below or in the live stream. I'm always really interested to know what you thought of the mission, guys. I think this has played out great. I've very enjoyed this mission. Fuck. Jimbo firing away. Damn, Jimbo, guys, just got a solid hit. Solid hit on that, is it, BTR? I always get these names wrong. Yeah, BTR. Damn it, nice shot, Jimbo. Guys, you remember some of the agony we've had with hitting some of these trucks and tanks before? Jimbo just got that straight on. Jimbo's doing a good job here. Holy shit, took that house down. Jimbo, one man army. There'll be nothing left for these guys by the time they get in there. I love this though, I love these guys like charging in, like this, you can hear like the engagement and fire already happening in the distance and the jets like flying in. Holy shit, another GBU strike in there. Oh that was a good GBU strike, like straight onto that BTR but he's he's survived it. I don't think he's burning off yet. Oh he's one wheel down though, one wheel down. and he's burning. Great, excellent GBU strike there from the uh, Griffin. Board sit rep. Oh my god. Look at the uh, look at the, the Apache 30 mil coming in on this as well. 30 mil hitting these guys in the open. Let's check back guys. Let's just check back over here and see what's happening with the team. Okay, these guys still got loads of time. They're just kind of investigating and checking what's going on. Although, strangely, I can't hear. Weird. Um, and after that, I oh, want to go. see if we can move through the buildings or if we move like along the line to clear that uh, area. Uh, Yeti, for you, maybe you need to use... Hey, the guys here, for one small group look, they've got quite a lot to deal with, so they're like, doing the right uh, thing in organizing and carefully uh, dealing with this. It looks to me like a GMJ, to be honest with you. Okay. Always go yeah, I'm not the scenario. best with dumb fire rockets, but if I can get close enough... That's good. That's good to hear that as well. You know, I always like it when people are happy to say, like, look, I, I'm not very good with this. That's always really, really important to do, guys. Oh, shit. Right, shots coming in through the forest right here. Look. It's always important to admit your limitations so that other people know it's critical, so that, you know, people, if other, someone else can take that role. Right? And look at him just laying it on here. Look, 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 look. Oh, awesome. <laughs> the guys are taking like no risks at all. No risks at all. I'm gonna get some mortar fire here. What? Oh, 
for the sappers. Not again. Yes, uh, is it possible to send a medic to our current position? We've got a man down. What I'm going to do right here. the day guys. Very annoying. I'm just gonna get some AAF guys in on this because it's too irritating. Oh what the hell? What's this guy? What's happening? What are you doing to me game? What is the game doing to me guys? What? This was never a problem, ever. Ever. I want to put one guy in here just to see if this works. <sighs> Fine. Fine. I don't know what the problem is, but I'm going to investigate it later. <sighs> Super annoying. Right, whatever. Let's crack on with this. We'll do without. I'm going to investigate that later. I'm going to test that later. We've had a slight issue like that lately, but anyway. Yeah, man down. Right, chaos is down here. Right, let's have a little overview of what's happening. Right, big group of guys pushing up across the hill here, look. I'm not going to worry about it. Shooting across into the compound here. Still see up on the hill here, look, all those Apache shots raining down. Is he wounded? I think he's dead. Oh, shit. Uh, hold on, hold on. Remember the key thing here is to try and capture some of those surrendered guys, not just to wipe everyone out. Chaos has actually pushed up solo here. He needs to really hold the line. Chaos needs to be careful. The objective here is to not run in like one man army. The objective is, you know, they've got plenty of time. They should work together as a group. Damn, that guy in the building is getting hammered though from over here at midnight on the hill. Midnight should be a bit careful though. Why is that guy over here not engaging? Look, there's a guy like right here. He could fucking light him up. Yeah, okay, that's better. Should have checked that one over there. What's that? It could be that he's using turret artillery, not artillery artillery. That was that was never an issue though in the past though. Is that a thing? Though? That's not a thing. But you still only have artillery fire mission though. So what's what's the difference, uh, Valenia? There's no difference. I'll investigate it later. Right, let's have a check back with the other team. Okay, the other team are coming closer into town, closer into town now. This is going to get back to uh, the classic, you know, where I want to be watching oh, two I'll operations at the same time. Yeah, I've sent. Good to have a couple of contacts from the uh, large sandbag position that you're closing in on. Have two hostiles. Whereabouts? Right in front of the middle of the uh, sandbag position, right inside there. Mark hostage on that. Guys in the hostage. Command to Reaper. Go for Reaper. So I'm gonna recast you uh, over to Bravo, uh, just to... Uh, Go to that location and see if they need assistance. Find out. Copy that. Send Alpha. Alpha 1009. Copy that, secure the area. Sending the Apache off to try and assist the other team there.
cleared up most of the area. It should just be the building. Okay, someone comes with me, I can go get them. They're being very cautious and rightfully so, but there is only one guy actually left in this. Trouble is, you never know. You never know with these. You really could walk into a whole compound of people, or you could end up with just one guy like here. Oh shit, this guy's on him though. Look, look, look. Bottom. That was spicy. He could definitely have gone for the headshot there. Whoa! Whoa! Calm down, Chaos. <laughs> I didn't expect that last one. <laughs> Put the headshot in just for the good measure. <laughs> Holy shit. Garfield and Neos are taking some hits here, medicking up. Go check out what's going on with the other team here. And they're pushing through here, look. Thing directly south of the uh, estimated position in the compound. I see it taking no risks at all. They've still got a lot of time. I think there's a case if there's a this is essentially the end stage of the mission where the, the time element sort of is not really so present. Midnight is really one man. You know, I've been very, uh, I've been very sort of uh, saying to the guys like, you know, they've done a great job, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But this, this soloing that we're seeing from some of the guys here, that's not so good. <clears throat> they need to be covering one another. Now, there's a difference, of course. With, you could still have someone scouting, so someone going out and checking ahead of the line and sort of keeping cover. Maybe that's what Midnight's doing here. Maybe he's just trying to keep an overview, keep a position, something like that. But um, I, I will say to them afterwards to remember, like, you know, they. That pushing ahead, like going in like one on one, you know, just it's you, it's dangerous and it's reckless and there's no need for it. You know, you need to stay with your group because it's not just about you going in and, and getting down. It's not just about you going in and getting down. It's also about the guys around with you as well. I think we can assume. Obviously Apache, by the way, just hitting one of the truck targets right there. Devil units on the corner here. If you're wondering why the guys' voices are all very quiet, it's because they all turn their voices down because the AI can hear your voice. So if your voice is quite loud, like on Acre, they will hear this. You can see, look, look at the AI, look, look at them scoping out these corners. The AI are very reactive, you can see. got to be real careful when you've got two people stacked on a corner like that because as you see like Drax steps out and the other guy's ready to fire it's a real you, you want to at least have one guy stood what the, the ideal situation here <coughs> would have been to have Wildcat standing and Drax crouched so at least you're kind of minimizing the chance of firing each other by the uh the Apache by the way as you can see it's only hitting targets quite far away from the units you don't want to engage with that 30 mil anywhere near because you can see like the fire is quite scattered on it so the last thing you want to do is be engaging like real close range let's go back and have a look at what's happening with the other guys here yeah so midnight look he's scouting around the area here uh the guys are just coming in on this compound might have to check the building to our left the north building as well Shoot him or whether they capture him. Let's get in here. Oh, oh, hostage. Well done, guys. Well yeah. done. There's one guy. Orange. Yeah. That guy was peeking through a suspend your disbelief hole in the floor. Hole in the floor there. <laughs> Alright, they've done a good job. They've got still one other compound to clear out over here. Let's get on this side and see what's happening. Right, the guys are getting ready to... Well, they're really getting ready to shit. Damn, look at that! Wildcat went to peek that corner and he got fucked up. Very hard sometimes to peek these corners. They're going in. AI being ballsy. This guy's getting ready. Oh, oh, oh. He's running away. Ah, he's gone. 
Oh dear. Don't run through the wall, you bastard. No, he's just keeping it tight. The guy's like ready for action. Oh, this isn't going to end well. I can just feel it. Jocko, though, Jocko. Nice. Jocko's got full control of the situation here. Shit, this is the guy who's coming in on the other side. Any, yeah, there's still one enemy here. Nice. nice. Oh, that's a hit. Drac is down. Drac is unconscious. One more guy hiding in the shed here. By the way, that's BS. They can't get in that shed, so I'm just putting this guy in. So I had to drag that guy out of there because he was in a shed they couldn't go into. So, right, they've secured the site and therefore secured the mission. There are a couple of guys over here, though, so I'm going to send them this direction. They'll probably clear around the area anyway. Let's go back and see what's happening over here. Okay, Midnight and Chaos are clearing through this okay. compound. I hit you in the legs. At least they've got two guys I can make on this bandages one. off of their bodies. I am so sorry, man. Yeah, well, you, you only you only hit me once. You're fine. I didn't realize that you uh, went around. I'm gonna load a new one. Careful of that tent over there. Yeah, copy that. I really want to nade it, but we've been... Oh, hostage here. Hostage here. Stable hostage here. And they've cleared the rest of this, though. Yeah, they cleared the rest of it. All right, we are very close to basically saying mission complete on this one, guys. Uh, they've got the hostage secure. I think what I'm going to do, though, is send this. There's a little three-man team here, and there's a little... I'm going to send these. Chaos and uh, Midnight have been pushing ahead of everybody else, and let's see if they'll pay the price for it. Come on, guys. Go, 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 go. This team going to do nothing. Oh, damn it. Why do they do this sometimes? I swear to God. Go! Do things! It's so bizarre how some units will not... Well, at least these guys right here. These guys are going to delay the others coming in. I was trying to... Like, here we go. Look, we've got our units coming in over the hill. Light him up! He's right there! Light him up! Fucking do it myself. Fucking AI. Chaos to our north. Ural just dismounted. Copy that. Thanks for that heads up, you just saved me. Bandaging now, won't be long. Team approaching, I would not recommend entering the compound from that angle. I was just trying to kind of put a bit of pressure with this unit to sort of show them like, hey, you know, you run out on your own. This is the kind of pressure you can end up. But look, they've had everybody come up onto them here from the other town. So those guys moved up here really fast. So that was good. All right. Well played, guys. Well played. This has been a really tidy one. Pushing in. It's clear. Let's just take a little look over here and see what's happening on this side of things. Yep. And I assume they're still dealing with a couple of the units over this side. Let me just communicate to Jocko. Uh, Jocko's team, this is LT. Do you read me over? Wait a minute. I don't hear Jocko, but I thought I saw him talking there. Might be too far away, guys, so I'm just going to move myself. I am quite, quite far away. I might be out of radio range. Jocko, this is LT. Do you read me over? Around three seconds. Awesome. Be on the radio channel right now. He's up. 
Nope, you didn't. <laughs> if command read me on this. Oh, it might have been because I was using all three. That might have been the issue. Command this RT read over. Just mention LT. Can you confirm the trace on the last compound complete? I'll uh, contact Bravo now. Bravo, this is uh, Command this is Bravo. We just cleared out the compound currently uh, between the perimeter and uh, medic access up. Uh, after that, we can take the next trace. Copy that. Did you read LT? Yeah, confirm. This is the actual. This is the last compound for them. They can just activate it at any time to complete that. So I, the reason I wanted to check. So they hadn't activated it because they thought like oh, there was still like another one to come. So they were kind of doing what they've been doing all mission. They were like prepping up, ready to go on to the next one. Uh, so basically, I just want to wait until they've secured that. Uh, still got loads of time on the clock. Actually, not that long if they... depends. They got like uh, you know, about 20 minutes, so they <laughs> got plenty of time. Hi, Commander Selty. This is Commander Selty. This uh, enemy rebel base is secure. You can start uh, transporting yourselves and your hostages back to base and also get the Bravo team picked up once they've uh, completed their trace and uh, cleared that out. Copy that, we're just getting cable charge delivered now by Hunter. Copy that. Uh, off to your uh, northwest register, Hunter. the guys again i just want to they are trying to find intel trace Take system shots from the uh, northeast side of the compound i just uh... right, that is their mission complete guys well done really well done to the guys now look Sounds good. this is command sir Garfield, Garfield has been like absolutely hammering, hammering that Land Rover for the entire mission. Okay, so look, let's just do like a little overview of this mission so far. So, you know, quite honestly, uh, it's been a really good mission. This has been a strange mission, says the stream chat. So much bad luck and screw ups. I've never seen anything like it before. Yeah, I know. I, I've actually been pleasantly surprised. I really enjoyed this mission. I think it was great. Uh, I think the guys, there, there was obviously some moments which went kind of wrong. I also think, you know, look, I helped them out a little bit on that base where the IEDs were and all those problems. I gave them a little five minute time extension. I pushed them a little towards what they needed to do. But other than that, they've done really good. They've done really good. And I think you guys would agree, their positioning has been so good compared to some other missions that we've had. Uh, communication has been good. I mean, I, I say, I think I heard some of the guys on the ground complaining a little bit about some team communications and stuff like that. But uh, from what I've seen, all in all, I thought it's been really good. So I think the guys have done very, very well. Awesome. I like how they've just left this guy. When's your next pub mission going to be out here? I honestly don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Try to do something this week, come out. Hard working pilot. <laughs> 